What's going on everybody? I'm back with another Grand Theft Auto 5 video and in today's video I'm going to be showing you guys how to get all of the gang and other modded Albany Mananas. As you can see this is the rarest Manana. Uh, it has a uh, modded like purplish bluish pinkish paint job. It has the gold rims that were already on there and uh, this one's actually the hardest one to get. But uh, I'll also be showing you guys how to get the gang versions, the purple, the green, and the yellow. And they can sell, they don't sell for a lot of money. They sell for about seven or eight thousand dollars. We'll go check that out in the Los Santos Customs later. But um, I think they're just cool to collect all the rare cars in the game. But uh, I'll, I'll, I'll be showing you how to do that today. And so let's get on into it. Uh, first, you want to go to the mission. Uh, two jobs, play job as always, Rockstar created missions, oh, oops and go to the, down to the mission time to get away I found that this one, if you have it, is better than uh, denial of service because they're both locked at the same time but time to get away does not have a uh, time limit on it and so it's still locked at 12 o'clock but doesn't have a time limit and there's also three other or four yeah, three other three other gang cars that you can get, four in total. Um, but I I think they're pretty cool to get. They're modded. They sell for more than the uh, original versions of each of them. And uh, so yeah, I'm, I'll be doing videos on each different kind of gang car. But I st also still have a lot of uh, regular modded cars left to do. But what you can do for this one, this one's really hard to get to spawn. I got lucky as I had it on the first try, but it comes th down this little alleyway right here. And so I'm going to circle around there once, and if it doesn't come through, then I'm going to go ahead and do the gang cars and then come back. So uh, what I usually do, I go around this little square, kinda, I take like a square route around this whole little town area. This one spawns about one in... I'd say 10 times you go through. It's pretty rare to get to spawn. There's another sp place that you can get it to spawn too. But the, it, believe it or not, it actually is different than the purple gang version. So what you want to do, you want to like creep up kind of right here. Because you give it a better chance to spawn. Kind of like, I'm, I just don't look. And then I turn right here and sometimes there's one coming out of that little alley right there but uh... I don't see one this time so I'm gonna go ahead and go over to the uh... gang areas and show you guys the different kind of mananas you can get over there there's a good chance that uh... it'll spawn a different car and if it does we'll just ignore that and save it for the next video but uh... most of the time it spawns the car that you're driving so you just go over here Okay, well here is the uh, yellow, this areas where the yellow car spawns. I don't see one right there. This is the one it spawns the most in. It's this little parking lot right here. Don't see one there. Sometimes it can spawn down here. I don't see a yellow one, but they're really common. Like, you can drive by there about any time of day, past 12, and they'll probably be there. So, uh, I'm not gonna, like, wait for that one to, uh, spawn in but uh, let's go on over to the purple and the green areas so here's where the purple one will spawn right on this little road over here this is actually where I found one manana he, it was coming out of that driveway right there and uh, so you can find it there too there's a purple one right there see here is the purple the, here's the purple gang manana and uh, somebody's driving in it right now so uh, I don't know if I'm gonna take it because I don't want to cause a bunch of ruckus but uh, it sell it sells for the same price as the one I'm driving right now all of them sell for the same price um, so it just depends on which one you want but there's the there that's the purple ballers manana and now I'm gonna go down and try to find the green one and I'm gonna take this path around it usually it usually spawns more when you go around to this side I don't know why that is but uh, it just does and all the mananas are the same color except for uh, except for the one that I'm driving right now and this is the only non-gang modded one you can get so it's I think it's pretty cool 
If you don't, I mean, I wouldn't recommend. Oop, there's the, uh, there's the green one right there. It looks like there's somebody getting in it. No, maybe I was just seeing things. But there is the green Manana right now, and so uh, they once again they all sell for the same price. So you can steal whichever one you want, really. They're really easy to get to spawn. So I'm not even going to get to worry about going to get the yellow one to spawn. But uh, I'm going to go try to find another one of these. And I'll be back when I find one. What's up, guys? I'm on about my fourth try right now. And as you can see, the uh, modded Manana just spawned right in front of me. This time it's actually parked. And I'll show you my location on the map real fast. So here's like the hood area. There's where you can find the green one, the purple... The yellow's over in here, and then you just drive down this little street right here, and that's where you it spawns. Sometimes it comes out of that alley, but this time it just happened to be parked here. And so, I'm just going to take it to show you guys that it's not like a friends or anything. There's no friends in this lobby with me. Uh, but yeah, this one's pretty rare. You never see anybody driving this one around on the street or anything. And, uh... Yeah, but I'll uh, I'll show you guys its price. All the prices are the same, like I said earlier. I'll show you the price in the uh, Los Santos Customs shop here in a minute. And uh, we're back now, and we're about to take this Manana that we just that I just showed you guys how to find. Uh, we're gonna take it into the Los Santos Customs. As you can see, I haven't changed anything, haven't modified it. Uh, this is what it was like straight off the street. But uh, I'm gonna show you guys how much it sells for, and it's not that much money, to be honest. Uh, there's like you can get the Dominator that will sell for way more, but honestly, it's just a cool kind of car to have. I think like you don't you'll never see anybody driving one around like this, and obviously it's rare. It's really hard to find. Um, the only way I know to find it is you have to. It has to be exactly at 12 o'clock. Anything before or after is like it's nearly impossible to find, and nobody really goes and looks for this kind of car anyways. Uh, so you'll definitely have a different feel to your garage with this in it. Uh, but I think it's a cool kind of car. It gives you the old classic kind of look. I'm surprised they didn't make it into a lowrider, to be honest. But I'm about to take it into Los Santos Customs. We're going to see how much this thing sells for. What brings you in today? Albany Manana Sports Classics. Obviously, you would hope not to wreck it on the way down here if you were trying to make money off of it, but uh, anyways. Uh, let's see. Sell. See, it only sells for 7520 but uh, the the other cars sell for the exact same. I checked before I made the video. Uh, this one, I think, is by far the coolest. Um, so that's about it for this video uh, like if you uh, want to see more videos like this and subscribe to my channel if you enjoy my videos